Hello everyone, it's Katie here from the Scrappy Sisters and I am up today with this layout for 30 Days of Sketches with Christy's Beautiful Life. This is the best of series. So this sketch uh, is by Laura Rumble and it was actually a sketch originally from series 5, day 26 if you're playing along at home. <laughs> um, and it's this gorgeous sort of corner rainbow design. So it immediately made me think of this cut file by Confessions of a Paper Addict. I think it's called Stitched Rainbow. I'm not 100% sure, but everything will be linked in the description box. Uh, so I cut it out on my silhouette. I stitched it in a silver or grey uh, thread. I did a chain stitch or floss, really, I should say, embroidery floss. Um, and then I backed it in one solid piece of cardstock. So this is using the Boho Baby collection from Simple Stories, which I love. It's definitely my jam. Uh, this is, I think it was my last ultrasound with Addison. Um, I'm looking at my layout now and I've actually covered <laughs> um, the how many weeks it says I am. But the ultrasound was taken in February and she was born in March. So it's got to have been my last. Uh, so yeah, she would have been 32 weeks, I reckon. I think. Uh, but anyway that's what I'm doing now I actually used oh what are they what do they call these um hang on I've got the packaging here let me find it it's the page pieces so simple stories released this like sort of small ephemera pack where they make like a double page layout on the back um and they use simple pages page templates and you can sort of create a layout following the page template um I didn't I just use the embellishments <laughs> um, but I basically used the whole pack of those the only thing I didn't use was the tag and in hindsight I totally should have just put it on because it's the only piece left <laughs> that I didn't use but that's okay um, now I did a little bit of this off camera so I actually ripped that top corner um, up there where the sort of sun and cloud and stuff is um, and I just added an extra piece of pattern paper in behind there it's a dark blue with the stars um, I laid my photo, which you saw, um, and I'm just popping up some foam underneath it. Because of the stitching, um, I needed to add the foam so that it would kind of sit above the stitching because the stitching is quite bumpy, and I knew I wouldn't be able to secure the photo onto the page uh, without that foam. So that's what I'm doing. And then I've got this cute little rainbow, which I'm adding, and then I'm just going with the title little one, which did come in the uh, page pieces. Uh, yeah, that's all I'm doing. I, there's not a lot to say <laughs> with this layout. Now, for the 30 Days of Sketches Best Of series, look, unless you've been living under a rock and you don't watch much YouTube, you will have seen this everywhere because there are a lot of people playing along. But Christy has done a marvellous thing this series, this round, and she's created a playlist. So everyone's been uploading their videos to that playlist. So um, there's not a million people linked in the description box. There's just a link to the playlist. So definitely go and check it out. You might find some wonderful new people to follow along. I think there's actually a lot of pretty newish, relatively small um, channels playing along. And I've really enjoyed watching some new people that I haven't seen before. So and subscribing, of course. So definitely go and check out uh, the playlist because I think you'll really enjoy it. And people take people's take on sketches is so varied uh, so obviously with this sketch I really just took the rainbow theme and kind of just everything else I went with whatever looked good so I'm only using one photo in Laura's sketch she's got three photos um, she's got a whole heap of journaling under her photos now I will do some journaling on this layout but I'm literally only going to say you know 32 week scan or whatever um, there's nothing else of real import uh, to note about this. <laughs> um, sorry, you can, might be able to hear my baby in the background. She's just waking up. And the washing, of course. I think I said this in my last video. The washing's going. <laughs> the baby's in her cot. And I think she's definitely stirring. She just squawked. I heard her. But um, she does this. I don't know if other people's babies did this. She does this kind of like she's asleep. But she does a little, just one squawk. But she's still asleep. Uh, so she's doing that but she is slowly waking so I may have to stop this voiceover and come back to finish it off uh, but anyway that's what I'm doing I didn't tell you this is day 15 uh, but you know it's the 15th of June I don't know when you're watching this but that's the date that it's going up uh, in Australia it actually goes up our videos go up in the evening at 7 p.m because we found that's a really good time to tie in 
with the other side of the world and so our videos are released on the right date if that makes sense um, so I released it on the 15th of June but it goes up the 15th of June in Australia in the evening and then it's like 6 a.m. for a lot of the US or something like that 5 a.m. I can't remember it's early <laughs> um, but it works that's what we found works best for us for hops and things like that it just sort of is a good time for both hemispheres um, obviously not right across the world you know it's not a great time for everyone but it works it works for us um, now I'm just scattering around in the page kit page pieces pack they had stars hearts and little flowers now ordinarily I wouldn't kind of mix all those things together but I did because they were in it and I just I wanted to use them so that's what I'm doing I'm also drinking a cup of tea excuse me while uh, it's actually a, um, doing this voiceover on the Queen's birthday weekend where you get a public holiday for the Queen's birthday not that it's actually the Queen's birthday but this is the day we get the public holiday it's the 13th of June um, so it's a Monday here and so everybody's home because it's public holiday we are well Lincoln and Danny are just recovering from COVID they have had COVID for the last week uh, Lincoln you wouldn't know he's a bit tired but that's about it Danny it, it did hit him quite bad he's had a lot of sleep um Addison and I did not get it we remained negative which I was very pleased by um for those of you playing along at home you will probably already know that I already had COVID when I was 35 weeks pregnant uh, with Addie um, and I, I managed to not pass it on to Lincoln or Danny at that point um, and so uh, just because of Danny still working and Addison being a bit of a restless sleeper she's very loud um, we hadn't been sharing a room anyway because Danny wants to sleep <laughs> Um, so I'm upstairs in our bedroom with Addison and he's currently sleeping in the spare room so I think that probably saved me <laughs> from getting COVID um, we haven't really been able to distance from each other around the house um, but he hasn't been picking up Addison or helping with Addison um, just to try to keep her COVID free um, it's impossible to socially distance from a three and a half year old um, so I'm just doing my best to not you know share drinks or food or anything like that um, but yeah I, I don't know how we managed to avoid it but we have um, so uh, they finish up their isolation today which is nice not that we would have gone anywhere anyway uh, but yeah so everybody's home everybody's sleeping apart from me right now <laughs> so I am enjoying the peace and quiet to do some voiceovering um, because I've been home for a week I haven't been able to do any crafting um, any voiceovering, any kind of me time, it's all been either with the baby, with Lincoln, or trying to help Danny feel better. Um, yeah, so, you know, I haven't had a lot of me time for the last week, which is fine. You know, that's that's life when you're a parent. Um, but, yeah, it's nice to have everybody napping at the same time. So I am just thought, oh, I better do these voiceovers quickly while drinking a cup of tea <laughs> and waiting for the washing. Um, so yeah, I also made a jelly slice today. Um, I've nearly finished. <laughs> so, you know, did my splatters. I'm basically done. Here's my close up. Sorry, I rambled on about life. Um, I haven't been able to talk to many adults lately. <laughs> Here's my close ups. Thank you for watching. Go and check everything in the description box below and we'll see you in our next video. Thanks guys. Bye.